guys. Um, so for me, homecoming's coming up. Homecoming's coming up. Um, and I'm just like, wow, I don't know what I'm gonna do with my face. And so I was like, maybe I'll just make myself a video and then watch it that day and then I'll know what I'm doing. So yeah, no, I'm kidding. All right guys, so this is the tutorial. Watch it, have fun. I gotta go, my camera's dying. I tried to film this thing like 12 times and it didn't work. I'm taking this color buff from the Lorac Pro 2 palette and a shadow brush and I'm just gonna put it, you know, like right under my brow bone and all over my lid. Because we're trying to get like a straight line type thing going on over here, um, I'm gonna apply like this medical tape stuff, like this. Um, you know, a lot of people use tape or whatever. Um, I like to use like band-aids or this stuff. Okay, so now I got these two like even strips and I'm just gonna place these like right under. I'm just taking this brush right here and I'm gonna pick up like a light brown transition color. Um, so I'm gonna use light brown from the Lorac 2 palette, Lorac Pro 2. Palette, and I'm just gonna put this right here, like above my crease. I'm gonna take this like brownish orange color from Inglot, and you can use something a little bit darker, but I just kind of like the orangish tones. So I'm going to take that and I'm going to put it right under where I put that. I have a brown color and this one is Sable from the Lark Pro palette and I'm just going to put that under, I mean, into my crease. I'm taking the color black and I'm just going to, well, you'll see. I'm making a little triangle kind of at the end of my eye. Now I'm just going to take a brush and I'm going to blend it out, um, but I'm kind of going to maneuver it outward into the cat eye shape. So I'm just going to put in a little bit more of that light brown. I'm get my little brush right here and I'm going to pick up the this like makeup setting spray and I'm just going to spray it onto my brush. All right. And I sprayed it on and now I have some product on my brush so I like my color is going to be a little bit more brighter. Um, now I'm picking up the color Rose from the Lorac Pro 2 palette. I'm taking a pencil brush and I'm picking up the color beige from the Lorac Pro 2 palette and I'm just going to put it into my inner corner and bring it under. brush with no product on it to kind of blend out that inner corner. Just to define your eyes a little bit more, we're going to go back in with a bit of a dark brown color and I'm going to go in over the black and I'm going to pull it in over this. going to go in with the color cream and I'm just going to highlight my brow bone. Applying 
my eyeliner and I'm leaving the tape on. So I'm just getting my eyeliner brush and I'm picking up a little bit of gel eyeliner. Off my tape. Um, now I'm just going to be taking a liner and I'm going to line my waterline. With the color beige, I'm going to brighten. I already did this side, but my camera died. I'm going to do this side. I'm going to go in with the rose, just like from here to like halfway. Just take black or a dark brown and you can just go in under here and blend it upward. Take um, the color sable. I'm gonna go in there. Brows are did, and now I'm just gonna put on some balm lashes. Grab a little bit of mascara. I'm going to prime my face. I'm going to take a bunch of concealer and I'm using the Maybelline Fit Me concealer and I'm just going to put that right here under my eye. Oh, oh this is fantastic. I look amazing. Alright, so that's your homecoming makeup. Um, yeah, have fun. No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> uh, where's my beauty? Okay, so now I'm just going to take this spongy thing and I'm gonna blend that out and because there's a little bit left on my brush I'm just gonna go like this and just kind of get it off onto my face so now I'm going to take foundation and I'm just going to put it onto my face, obviously, because this foundation is taking forever to... Oh! That happened. I'm going this out right now before it touches my scarf. And I didn't put it like right here because I already highlighted that part. foundation stick and I'm gonna contour by making a line right here oops I messed up a little all right so I'm gonna blend this out a little bit and blend it a little bit more with the brush and I'm gonna take that same thing and you know I'm just gonna go like right here Go ahead and use a brush to blend that out because um, my contour palette and I'm gonna take the darkest color in it and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set that that cream or foundation stick whatever with this powder so brush again and I'm going to take a lighter color and I'm just going to blend it out. Take this brush again and I'm just going to put in a little bit of bronzer 
um, not where I contoured, but like over it, like, you know. I'm gonna be using this blush from MAC, and I'm gonna smile a little bit and put it onto the apples of my cheeks and bring it up. brush right here and I'm gonna pick a little bit of like a highlighting powder for my contour palette and I'm gonna put it right above right here um, whatever's left on my brush I'm just gonna go up my nose put a little bit onto my forehead right here mm -hmm. oh what's that is that freaking concealer and then yeah, whatever is left over, I'm just putting right here and here. And if you want to contour your nose, you can do that. I'm just going to take a very light color and I just do a little bit. I feel like I don't need to do too much on my nose. And I just kind of took off the product from this brush and then picked up a light brown color. I'm going down the sides of my nose and right here. Alright, so that's done. You can set this with a translucent powder. But I'm just going to be applying lipstick, and this is Diva by MAC, and yeah. So, I'm pretty sure me putting on lipstick wasn't in the frame, but yeah, this is my lipstick. Um, if you are going to an event, though, where you're going to be there for a while and stuff, you probably want to put on lip liner, which I didn't do because I couldn't find it. But yeah, do lip liner so it stays longer and all that other stuff. Um, so yeah, this is the face. Alright guys, so this is the completed look. Have fun wherever you're going and don't forget to comment, subscribe, um, thumbs up my video. And also I have an Instagram that I just started. Actually, I started a long time ago, but I just like never mentioned it. It's M-U-A-I, wait. I don't even know how to spell it. Oh, it's M-U-A-N-I-S-A-H. And yeah, follow me and stuff. It's fun. Um, thank you so much for watching my videos. It means so much to me. Bye.